Oh boy, we got some work to do today. Yesterday's video was just not good. It was way too short and I totally missed a bunch of character and story progression. On the bright side though, I am leveling quicker than I was on my Flak playthrough. We're 18 at nearly eight hours. As Flak, we were 15 at pretty much the same time. And we're deep into 18 right now. We're almost 19. Another thing to note is I've slowed my pace down a bit. Like yesterday, I did that low level quest that took some time. And like if I was just running through and doing no video or commentary or anything, I feel like I could have easily cut down my time by like an hour, maybe even two two hours the hover wheel has 17 speed the mono wheel has 17 speed also okay well let's do the hover wheel i guess i thought for sure this thing would be slower maybe it is slower if you do enable the hover mode yeah i think it is quest right here in like a level 13 zone 14 it's a trivial yeah we're not doing that that's gonna give no XP. This is trivial, guaranteed. I feel like Borderlands kind of follows the same formula as WoW does with like the leveling system and the XP system. And like, if it's green, it's okay. But if it's gray, AKA trivial, it's not gonna be okay. It's gonna give like no XP, I'm guessing. All right, so we gotta head to the Secret Atlas HQ entrance, which this is a zone we've already been in. Don't need to talk to Zero. I can just go in by myself. Come up to my office slash museum grade aquarium and I'll get you that tasty key fragment. Now I just have to find where Zero disappeared to. I like the strategy just shooting a couple times and just throwing these guns and just letting them kill stuff for me. And then I run out of ammo really quick. Like every time you do throw a clip, it will consume like 20 ammo. But it's a lot more easy way of doing things. I just killed all those dudes just by not even aiming. Like, I don't even have to aim. People are saying, why don't you aim down your sights? Why even aim at all when you can just let your guns do the aiming for you? Oh yeah, I should probably go over a couple of our upgrades because yesterday I just did not show any type of progression of the character at all. Like, for example, we actually picked up a few epic class mods, but this was by far my favorite uh, as this increases weapon damage by 11%, which is amazing. That's just 11% more damage on all of our weapons and 18% more handling on all of our weapons, which reduces recoil. It also gives us bonus stats to a couple really nice skills. This skill I actually never went over, but it's a kill skill. And every time we kill an enemy, we get lifesteal for now. Now 15 seconds because of the death falls close skill which increases the kill skill bonus and duration it says it gives 10% life steal but death falls close boosts that by 25% I believe so that'd be what like 12 and a half percent life steal regardless our class mod gives us two points in the skill we've only invested three into it currently and the class mod also gives us one point in playing dirty which makes it so after we kill an enemy our next five shots have a chance to fire an additional projectile our class mod also gives us two points in this kill skill whenever we kill an enemy me and the clone get increased gun damage and health regen for a few seconds which i mean health regen is obviously great and gun damage is great percentage health regen is really good for us because we got this amazing epic shield which gives us 50 percent more max health and five percent max health per second while shields are full and the great thing about this shield is it has a really low recharge delay so only after 3.7 seconds of not getting hit we'll regen our shields back up and it recharges fairly quickly but yeah this is definitely the best shield i've come across thus far oh yeah and then i found this amazing shotgun that has a 40% chance to electrocute for 181 damage per second and it has plus 300 splash damage radius and when it does electrocute an enemy like right there it electrocuted this enemy it takes so much damage per second and it pretty much gets one shot at like I guess I have to finish it off but it's basically a 40% chance for an insta kill and it has splash radius really cool shotgun and it's really good against shielded enemies oh two blues in this gun crate incendiary pistol that has splash damage and i actually forgot we did just pick up another incendiary pistol i'll try this one out first because it seems a lot better like it's 247 item score and it does splash damage i think that's awesome Vault Hunter Atlas is, is safe. now i just uh, have to find zero oh don't worry about zero please Mind games won't work, Katagawa. Zero's on my side. Oh, oh, see, see? He, he just walked in. I'm looking at him right now. Zero, man. Man, everyone's just completely lost it. What? Zero, what are you doing? All right, so apparently Zero backstabbed Reese, and now we got to save Reese. Zero, come on, man. I, I, I thought we were friends. <laughs> You should have joined the family, Reese. All right, so this boss fight is actually fairly easy. Like I did it on my level 15 character. This was as far as I got in the story. 
Um, essentially, he will just spawn clones that will start chasing us, or the actual one. Is that the actual one right there? No, I don't think so. I think the actual one's up here. Yeah, that's the actual one up there. And then we can melt him pretty quickly, and then we just gotta break through the shield, and then he's gonna reset. And we did break through some of his HP. He teleports away, and then he spawns more clones, and we have to figure out which clone is the real one. But like, he just doesn't do much damage. It's a really easy fight. Oh, there's like a time limit. And so if we don't kill his clones by a certain time, then he'll just spawn more. Okay, so I gave up on this. We're just gonna have to, I'm just gonna finish him myself. I think that's it. Where is he? Oh, here he is. And kaboom. Well done, Vault Hunter. Thank you for saving my bro. That creep is finished. You disappeared on a zero. I was on the hunt. Could not give myself away. Radio silence. Like I said, Zero, I super trusted you the whole time. And it was completely justified. As for you, Vault Hunter, I owe you everything. You fought off an all-out corporate assault, saved my company, and killed my creepy business stalker. But before I give you this key fragment, I have one last thing to ask of you am i pulling off this mustache or what everyone's been non-stop dumping on his mustache and i'm just not down with bullying it's perfection itself i am happy near proud to call you my mustachioed brother thank you vault hunter i will remember that here you go one vault key fragment as promised all righty so this is as far as i've gotten be a long time before malawan forgets the thrashing you gave him let's see the calypsos try to spin that now We've got an opening and we're gonna take it. Reese, where's that vault? First off, I wanna say a little something. You saved my skin and the skins of every Atlas employee. And skin's important. Stop saying skin. Right, the vault. It's hidden underneath the Apollyon Transit Station. It's in the middle of the city? How did no one ever find it? The old Atlas Corporation just paved right over it. I found it when I took over, but I wasn't about to pop the top on that thing in a populated area. Opening a vault is messy stuff, but I'll leave that up to you, Reese. Oh! We'll have to be fast. We go in through the Skyway by vehicle. Got it. I'll take point with the Vault Hunter. The vault is close now. Whatever power is inside, the Iridians locked it away for a reason. You must not let the Calypsos acquire it for themselves. We're close to the vault, huh? And there's just psychos guarding it. That's it. What is this thing? What? The actual vec. That's what I'm saying. They protect the vaults from crazy enough to Okay, can you stop talking and can we just kill it? Level 28 Wraith, huh? It says skull, but like... Okay, yeah, that's actually bad. That means we're way underleveled for this. But I mean, like... We're kind of just melting it. This quest is level 19, so I'm not really sure why the mob is level 29. Maybe that was just like a... Anomaly? I mean, it wasn't that strong. Okay, here we go. Level 18 Wraith. And these guys have shields, so you already know that I'm just going to be chucking this weapon non-stop. Yeah, like, they're just getting killed so quickly. That was not hard at all. I mean, notice this gun will crit a lot if I do throw it on the ground. Like, I don't know if it's because it's, like, hitting enemies from behind and that will crit. Why do I have so much ammo, by the way? I was at, like, zero ammo and now I have full ammo. Just randomly. All I know is I'm getting so much XP here. There's a summer 700 XP from killing something and then see all the crits they're going out like I don't know why that is They're so good at critting though Lilith, We're in Maya, Ava's gone. She'll be swarming everywhere. Take Looks like we're on our own vault hunter. Wow <sighs> wasn't sure I'd ever see another vault. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you brought me back Imagine all the people who lived out their lives on the surface above Never knowing they were standing on top of them. Get ready. Imagine, the dude. The sealed inside the vault has been sleeping for millennia. It's gonna be pissed when we wake it up. There. That arch is the entrance. Put the key in that pedestal. 
Dude, what if we were on top of a vault as we speak? Let's see what and by we, I mean me or you. Here we go. Whoever watching this video could be sitting on a vault right now and they wouldn't even know. Looks like we can do incendiary damage to this thing though and it will actually do work. Okay. Go run. Can't tell if we're doing good damage to it. Maybe I should try a different gun. Maybe let's try tossing out a bunch of these assault rifles. Maybe let's try using this gun and just toss out a bunch of these turrets to get the fight started. Am I dead? Wait, Maya might revive me, or Ava, or whoever that is. Oh, there's some race on the ground. Okay. I can't tell if we're doing good damage to it. I think we, I think we are. It's just really tanky. Now's our chance. Light this thing up. Light this thing up. Okay. Hit the back, maybe. Not taking any damage. Next phase. Where are they? What are we shooting? Things at the top. Oh. Maybe I should have shot more of those things. That's not good. Why does this phase seem easier than last phase? Like he's not on me at all. What in the world? Hit it with everything you've got. Already on it, baby girl. To be honest, like, I mean, this fight is not feeling like it's that difficult. I haven't got hit by something in a while, I feel like. Okay, this time I think we should kill the little things in the air if they do spawn. Okay, I got you. I don't think my turret will aim at them though, because, like, they have no health bar. I don't really know if there's any point. Holy cow, that hurt. We gotta run from that. Holy crap, this place is getting wrecked. Oh man. Hope that wasn't load bearing. Okay, whenever he does a little yep, I gotta run whenever he does Holy that. Crap, this place is getting wrecked. Yeah, you said that already. The place down. You said that already too, we already know. Let's try out some new guns. Epic pistol, and then let's try out this level 19 assault rifle, which might be pretty good here. Ow. Okay, that might not be good. Can I get a health bar? Crap. Can she res me? She's gonna res me. Oh, easy. Okay, that's doing no damage. So, no shotgun. What about assault rifle? They're doing good damage? I don't know, this thing's just really tanky. I think it's doing good damage. Yeah, I think that's good. I'm just gonna overheat though. It's about to overheat. What oh, this gun? What is this gun even? I don't even know what this is. Oh crap, I ran to the wall. Hit it hard, okay. No, not that gun. Finish it off. It's dead, I think. Oh, I see legendary icon on the ground. On the map. I see another one. I think. I think I saw two. 
Maybe there's Holy someone. Shite! Did you see that? That was a masterpiece of badassery. <laughs> Seriously. Good job. Hell yeah! That was awesome! Ava? I told you to wait on the ship. Epic it pistol. isn't safe here. And this a chance to see a real vault? Look at this place. Ava, you're not a vault hunter yet. There's a lot more to it than running headfirst into danger. Right, yeah. Hey, Ava, you dummy. Vault hunter, you should go inside. Take your time. I need to have a chat with my apprentice. So we got a legendary rocket launcher, and I'm pretty sure this drops from the boss every time. It does a radiation damage too, so I think that thing's really good. I think I can definitely now replace my level 13 rocket launcher. And yeah, it does more splash damage radius. Although it does consume two ammo per shot, but it's doing way more damage, I think. And yeah, the radiation damage is more, and there's a higher chance to radiate enemies. Iridian resonator. It pulses and seems to sing in your mind. Start smashing stuff. With the melee. Oh. Fascinating. This vault is linked by an ancient energy conduit to a second vault. Those coordinates look like Eden Six. Good work, Vault Hunter. We have our next destination. Ava, I'm trying to keep you safe. By just ditching me on the ship? You said I could be a Vault Hunter like you. You promised. You will. When you're ready. What's up, bitches? Ow, Troy, look what they left for us. <sighs> Thanks for doing all the hard work. Man, <laughs> you vault thieves only think with your trigger fingers, huh? Keep this up and I'll be a god for real. Uh, we'll be gods. That's what I said. Now, let me do my thing. No! What are you doing? Taking what's ours. See, the monsters don't protect the power of the vaults. They are the power of the vaults. And now it's all mine. Hey, save any for the parasite? Gah. Uh, can we shoot them? We're leaving. Now. We should be kicking their ass! Yeah, what, what are we doing? So who's the brat? You I get, but what's her deal? She's no one. I'm your problem. I'm gonna be a sire, uh, and then I'm gonna mop the floor with assholes like you! You're gonna... <laughs> Is that how you think this works? Honey, you're not even gonna leave this place. <laughs> Put her down. Where do we go in all this? That's what I thought. Maya! Ava, don't. Okay, we're just sitting there watching, I guess. Ready. out for you. <laughs> yeah, we just watched her die. Okay. Seems legit. She's dead. 
Maya's dead. Lass, we've got to go. Lilith, you have to say something. Fine, I'll say something. I knew Maya when she was alive. I preferred her that way. That didn't come out right. But she's gone, and that's how it is. All we can do is fight to honor her memory the best we can. People die in wars. By the droves. I mean, open your eyes, people. Don't ask me to speak at your funeral, Lilith. She's not dead a bit. No kidding. Maya wasn't just a crimson raider or a vault hunter. She was family. But we can't lose sight of our mission. We're going to open the vaults. That's how we make her death mean anything. It's all good. She's not dead. She's that book thing, and we're going to be able to get her back. That's my prediction. I don't know if that's actually true. Vault hunter. Not much to say, you know. It's a war. People die. No, she's not so dead. There, when you're old enough... We'll get absolutely shite faced and sing songs about her till a trip. Okay, yeah. Vault Hunter, good, you're here. We need to set a course to Eden 6. No time to waste. Tennis took the vault down on Promethea with Nike some XP, very nice. One on Eden 6. If the Calypsos want to get their hands on that vault, those Ooh, monsters legendary. are going to have to go through us. Luckily, we have a friend in the area. Wayne Rod Jacobs, at your service. I'm sorry to report that those COV zealots have kidnapped Hamelon. And it seems they're here for me. One step closer and I'll whoop you with lead. I'll emblaze my family crest on your craven ass. So we got this legendary SMG cloud kill, which does corrosive damage. So we probably don't need any more corrosive weapons. <laughs> oh man, this is going to be flashbacks oh, of the hunter I guy. I could give you the proper Jacobs. Welcome to Eden 6, but those COV devils are everywhere. Me and a few survivors are holed up in my family's lodge. Supplies are running low and we're surrounded. I need your help. Oh. Vault Hunter, you just saved my damn life and I am in your debt. Let's talk. Behind you, dude. My name is Wayne Wright Jacobs, but I'm afraid my name's all I have left. Devils have taken everything else. Well, come on in. We got company. Help yourself to some firearms. I salvaged what little I could from my father's personal collection, but he can't use them now. Those twin Calypso devils murdered him and took everything from me. And if you hadn't come along, I reckon I'd be in the mud too. I escaped with my life, but they captured my partner, Alistair Hammerlock. Those devils are holding him as leverage until I cough up the vault key. Which is also why you're here, I presume. Bingo. That vault has been a family secret for generations. We didn't want our fair paradise to be torn asunder like what happened to Promethea and Pandora. Where there's a vault, there's always a war. But right now, I've more pressing concerns than my family legacy. Alistair Hammerlock, love him a life. If they kill him, I got nothing left. If my father was still breathing, he'd tell me to march right up to those devils and negotiate with the smoking end of a Jacob's firearm. So that's exactly what we gonna do. See, that cult is holding Alistair in a prison called the Anvil. I already sent a team of mercenaries to break him out, but I ain't heard from them since. Rescue Alistair, and I'll get you that damn vault key. I remember this guy, Brick. Later. Now, I should warn you, Crunk Bunny is a damn prodigy with explosives, but how do I say this? She's nuttier than squirrel shit. I would say that's pretty nutty. Move and you die. <laughs> I will now read the crimes of the condemned. You kidnapped my. You moved. Whatever. Okay, so hold up. I actually did not connect the dots until I read All Grown Up Still Insane, just because it's been so long since I played Borderlands 2. But for those of you guys who don't know, or for those of you guys who don't remember, Tina was in Borderlands 2, but she was a kid. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the wild child, the queen of obscene, that girl who'll make you hurl. Tiny Tina! Ayo, baby, yourself. Came to free Hammerlock. Okay, look, here's the deal. 
They're keeping hammy locks in max security, and there's a big old door that needs blowing up. But, uh, but shit's got complicated, and some bandits took my bomb! I'm okay. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm okay. So, do me a flavor and grab some toppings for this bomb ass pizza I'm cooking up. Full disclosure, it is that. Man, I missed the Borderlands 2 characters. I don't even know if that guy's a Borderlands 2 character. Is he Borderlands 1? I'm pretty sure he's Borderlands 2, right? I don't remember the hawk making like noxious, annoying noises while playing. I literally couldn't play the hunter character in this game because of the annoying noise that the pet makes. Why they don't have an option to disable it, I don't know. Excellent, a vault hunter! Alright, well, our legendary SMG is gonna be perfect for this guy. Just gonna melt that armor real quick. Those rockets are just moving so slow, man. All right, now we are through the armor. Come to get out an incendiary weapon of some sort. Back to this pistol, I guess. This thing was doing work. Holy crap. See, he's not messing around. He's taking so much damage from this pistol though. This thing is like actually super good still. Oh yeah, one shots those guys. Oh. All right, well, bye bye to the warden very soon. I don't know what he's doing over there, but he's not gonna be okay. Yeah, he's healing up, I guess. Super raging warden. He just takes so much damage from this pistol, though. This thing is just so good. Overall, just a good thing to get kills. Okay, he's going into. Nope, he's not healing. I thought he was gonna heal. Well met. Now, if you could just lower the cage, you think you can shoot to lower the cage? I don't think I can shoot to lower the cage, eh? Well, that. I'm free. Will overkill? Catch you later, Vaulty Vault. Beat him up. My thanks, Vault Hunter. I'm not too worse for wear, all things considered. I'm glad that Wainwright sent you. Now, as to my incarceration, I'm sorry to say the one who traded me to those wretched Calypso twins in exchange for the Jacobs Corporation. That vile creature is my own sister, Aurelia Hammerlock. As to why she sold me to the cult, yeah, simply put, she despises me. She always has. I shall rest here a moment and meet you back at the lodge. Vault Hunter, you magnificent bastard! You did it! Now I am truly in your debt. Vault Hunter. My sister contacted you, didn't she? Yeah, Aurelia wants to pay me to leave the planet. That damn harpy! Anything Aurelia offers in one hand is only to distract from the knife in the other. If you set foot in that manner, she will try to kill you. Which is why we're going. Winnie! Vault Hunter, you did right by us, prying Alistair from the fangs of those zealots. Now, Jacobs is true to his word. I'll get you that vault key, but that means both you and I are going into that harpy's den together. Ah, so the whore reaches for the cash. I knew you'd come. A vault hunter's loyalty is always for sale. Come to the manor and you'll get your money. Right on time, vault hunter. Please do come in. That woman can 
make even proper hospitality sound sinister. But go along with whatever she says while I search the cabaret. I'll be with you in just a moment. Wait for me in the dining hall and we'll discuss your payment. Hall. Oh. Holy me! You should see the look on your stupid face. The vault thief! As promised. Not bad, Baroness. But you still owe us a vault key. I am working on it as we speak. Well, I will leave you to your fun. Good doing business with you, Vault Hunter. <laughs> this is awesome. We haven't really had a chance to get to know each other, huh? And Ty's been doing most of the talking. She does that, right? She's the center of the galaxy, and the rest of us just sort of orbit around her. But things are changing. Freaking look at me! I I've never felt this good in my life! Whoa! What is this? What is this? Your siren friend? She didn't know what she had. With this power, I can pull the stars out of the sky. You know, Tyreen says we should let you keep playing along. Yeah, a little competition gets our followers all riled up. <laughs> but I'm not one of them. No, not anymore. I'm done getting table scraps. Fill your hands, you zealot scum! Huh? Oh, I'ma kill you! Come and get me, you rat-faced bastard! the cabaret. I'll keep this punk ass rat boy running around like a jabba with his bunghole on fire. I lost him. Vault Hunter, the cabaret theater's up ahead. Push through. Hey, Vault Thief. Wanna see something your dead siren friend couldn't do? Yes! Feel my power run through you! He just made a boss out of the thing? Why doesn't he just do that to every mob? Maybe it's like something you can only do every once in a while. We have to. Oh, okay, I suck it. Playing jump rope. That's a, that's a loot tank. Oh. I think it despawns after a while if we don't. Well, I'm not gonna kill it, I don't think. Oh, I thought I'd, my drone. The loot tank. Crap. I'm gonna die here in a sec. I wanna kill a loot tank though. So close. Oh, we got it. Alright, Billy. It's your turn now. Okay, I don't know about that one. I'm not gonna kill that elite fanatic. Oh, there's a fnag behind him and he's hiding. There goes a lot of money. We had like 50k. Minus 6k. Oh, man. Got my barrier. I hope it blocks that. It doesn't even block the ability. Like, that's how broken it is. Jump that one. Okay, good. Maybe I just don't jump until he uses move. Actually, not that bad. Oh. For I'm about to get killed, but I'm just gonna get killed right by this fanatic. Fanatics right here. Finish me off, yes. Holy crap, this guy's so hard, dude. We got him down to, like, I don't know, below half at least. It's the best attempt. What I'm doing this time is I'm not jumping randomly. Oh. That's definitely helping. And then my drone's up. This could actually work. This could be it. I was getting so demotivated. But, like, it's not that hard of a fight. I don't know why I was making it so hard on myself. 
He's gonna die. Like, I I'm getting into the point where I can just kill him, even if I go down. Holy crap, I got him. Like, I just had to think about it for a second, and then it was fine. Yeah, like, why doesn't he just keep making them? Like, the fact that the guy can just make a unit like that is slightly disturbing. Oh, whoa. I wouldn't even think to, like, actually smash him. Of course. He meant record literally. Records as old as Jacob's kind of operation, and I got the only Ligno phonograph player in the entire system. If he wanted to leave me a message, that must be it. Bring it on back to the lodge, Bald Hunter. Got it, boy. I'm my way back. Bald Hunter! So you spoke with my sister and lived to tell the tale. Never mind the harpy. That record. May I see it, Vault Hunter? Still can't believe the Calypso's murdered my father. I need to get my record player working, but you know Aurelia's gonna send all those damn zealots to find us. If we're gonna last long enough to open that vault, we'll need an army of our own. I'm talking a Jacob's Resistance. It's time to take Ooh, back 11K XP. six, and we'll start with the town of Reliance. I hired a gunslinger named Clay to lend a hand. He's waiting for you outside the town. We're at about the 36 minute mark, and I think that's a good place to end the episode. In the next episode, I'll be showing off a new spec that I did theorycraft, which is going to improve our survivability and just make the game in general a whole lot easier. And surprisingly, though it gives us a ton more survivability, it doesn't really nerf our damage much. If anything, I think it actually improves our damage. But yeah, we'll be doing that as well as some more story progression in the next episode. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you then.